Hello! My name is Zisto. Welcome back to Super Hostile Legendary, the latter days of our adventure in this super, super stupidly large map. It was, man, the, the walking time from here back to the end of Sanity is extreme. Anyway, <clears throat> last time I got uh, pretty much all the way to the end of this area. Hello, zombie pigman. And got to what I thought was going to be the wall. Oh, come on, guys. Come on, guys. Out of the way. Out of the way, zombie pigmen and brothers. Out of the way. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. So there's two pieces of wool left, the black and the red. And I think one of them's going to be in this box right over here if I could ever... Oh, dude. Dude. And I don't want to hit this guy because, man, these zombie pigmen spawn all over the place. I don't want them sla slashing me in the back with their golden swords. All right, so there we are. Right over there is where I think the wool is. There's a bunch of monsters over there. I wonder, I think I have to walk around this uh, this gap right here to get into this big open area. But now I, I kind of want to assault... Oh, guys, get out of the way. I want to assault this, um, this little end area from the other side. So as soon as I can safely pickaxe these blocks without these zombie pigmen getting in the way. I'm going to uh, break them and... Oh man, I'm so tempted to just murder these guys. Out of the way, guys. Out of the way! Alright, just move. Oh, see right there? He turns around. No! Go away! Alright, just stay there, okay? Stay there, don't move. Don't move. Don't move. So there is the wall very inconveniently placed. It keeps me from uh, TNT cannoning. I would just lob a bunch of TNT at at those uh, um, arrow dispensers, but uh, I'm, I'm quite paranoid that doing so... Let me put some light in here. Lava bucket ho! I'm quite paranoid that doing so will blow up the wall and it will fall into the abyss there. Um, so I'm just gonna have to try and get back there and approach it rather tactically. I ran out of food last time I was here, um, but uh, I think I think I can I think I can get it done this time if I'm careful enough without too much trouble. And I'm just assuming that there is some. Uh, some location after this, that this is not the last location. There's some super fortress, like the, uh, what was the last one in Kaizo Caverns? The Citadel of Demons, I think. There's going to be something like that. This, uh, this whole area has been rather cramped and enclosed. We went down that spider or bat or whatever that thing was. We went down his throat. And uh, we've been in these little corridors the whole time. Let me get this lava back. I just wanted some light, actually. I want to put some light there and some light there. I don't really need light back here. I just I want the whole area to be generally brighter. Get that spreading good. All right. And then uh, I'll put some in the center here. Again, just for more light. No, for, not for any other purpose. See much brighter. Oop. I guess I have to let it spread for a little while. Not for any other purpose except for the brightness. And I'm getting close enough that uh, those spawners are going to start to activate. Things are going to start to get hairy. Oh, yep, they just did. And I know that because it just got quite a bit laggier. All right, give me that back. Yep, see them flashing, flashing away. All right, here we go. So, um, there, oh, you know what? I bet I could lob some TNT safely at them. I bet I could. Let me get out my TNT, which I did bring along. <clears throat> uh, let's see. I can't use water, obviously, to make uh, a TNT can that I can use over and over. But what I can do is something like this. God, I hope I don't blow that up. <laughs> oh, please don't blow that up. So I just want to trigger this one sooner than this one. Like that. No! Oh, shit, I'm, I messed it up. I messed it up. I couldn't reach. Okay, it's still there. <laughs> Whoops. 
Um, it was hard to see the uh, the square that I was trying to hit. There we go. And did I hit anything? I did. Oh, I did. Look at all those arrows. Good. Um, that's much better. And I, I guess I only need to approach it from one side. Once I can get back there, I can just move sideways and it shouldn't be a problem. I was really worried about blowing that up. All right, now that I've done that, let me uh, put my food back in the bar. Uh, lava buckets. Top that off. And I'm just going to continue forward like I was before that. So, at least I won't be getting shot by the arrow dispensers. And hopefully I took out some spawners as well. Can they see me yet? Um, I don't know if they can. Well, they I mean, they can see me. I don't know if they can shoot me if they have line of sight. Alright, guys. Last time I got in here, it got quite hairy. Yeah, like this. Let me go ahead and do that. And then I can back up a space. See all those... Man, that is creating a lot of lag. <clears throat> can I get shot right here? See if I can place some lava! Bucket hole! I cannot reach anything. I'm gonna have to break this block and move forward at some point. Uh, you know what? Let's do this for a second. Hey, oh, lava bucket hole! Haha! <laughs> Haha! Oh, back up! Okay, back up while that spreads. Don't blow up the wall, please. Whatever happens, that's all I care about. Yes! Alright, get a block a little bit lower. I need to go one block lower to be able to walk down there. Then I want to place it on something so I can... I just want a banister so I won't get ch shot off of here. Okay, and then let's place a block in front of that. There we go. Alright. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yes, jump in the lava. Alright, back up momentarily. I'm gonna eat some bread. I think I have this place pretty much finished. Or not finished, but um, solved as a puzzle. Um, that one piece of TNT really did help. Uh, opening up the entrance. Now I just need to... I still can't reach any box. Hey guys! Let's get some... I want some light in here. Yeah, let's put some lava there. Hi guys! Whoa! And then as soon as that spreads a little, I'm gonna dump some lava back here as well. Me that. Hey, oh, hey, hey, guys, you might want to look behind you. <coughs> hey, guys, look behind you. <laughs> oh, look, they were swimming up and to get to me. That's so cute. Oh, look at that. I didn't even see that. Pay attention. Okay, um, okay, so there's dudes there. Let's go get those guys. Hey, yo, go away. Oh, yeah, I have a bow and arrow. Why don't I shoot him with that? Say goodbye, spawner. Number one of many. Okay, to get up here, light up that, and then I just want to put that there to keep a guy popping up in that far one from shooting me. Wow, this place is big! This is bigger than I thought it was going to be. And then I just want to... Uh, Oh man, move forward a little bit at a time. Look at all these guys. Well, I guess I need to move up as high as I can get. Oh boy. And eat another piece of bread. I thought this place wasn't going to be as big as it is. But uh, I'm going to completely shut down everything before I do anything else. Uh, you know what? 
now that I'm back here, I think it's time for some more TNT. Oh, I can't reach it! Damn it! Okay, back up. <laughs> Whoops. I could not reach it. Damn it, I couldn't reach it again. Oh, shit! <laughs> Man, all the arrow fire is just so annoying right now. Alright, let's try this again. Maybe if I stand up here, it'll be easier. Hey oh Yeah! <laughs> That's just what I wanted. Help me break in here and do some damage. Alright, now that I did that, uh... Where's my lava buckets? Let's go back to some lava bucketing. Ho! Oh. That should help me get all the way back to the back. Once I get to the back, moving forward through this should be easier because all the, uh... Everything is set up to keep you from going this way, not that way. <laughs> Fire arrow! Out of nowhere! So, uh, this little area back here is a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be, but I still think I can, I can manage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man, the lag is insane right now. Even on my, I have a pretty beefy computer, and my lag is pretty outrageous. Here we go, and let's um, let's put some lava up in there. While we build our way back here, hey guys. Oh shit! I actually have to use the mushroom soup. Some way back there. Oh, we're almost there. We're almost to the back. Then I can start shutting all this stuff down. Get blown up, guys. Thank you. And run away. I have to rebuild a lot of that. Yeah. <laughs> oh shit! He got me with the arrow. Damn it, scumbag! Let me just make it harder for them to get me. All right, and have another piece of bread. Moving right along. All right, I feel quite a bit better about this place now. Hey! -o. And now I think it's time to pop down here and start taking care of these spawners. Oh, is there a passage there to the left? It looks like there is. Let me break that. Come get some! That's alright guys, I have a diamond sword. Whoa! He's coming from force! Alright, um, have one of that. Ha-ha! While I jump back here and... Wait for you all to burn to death. That's my last piece of bread, looks like, but I... I think I'm pretty good at everything else. I am low on cobblestone. Uh, but, I don't know, hopefully I won't need it now that I'm already back here. Let's pick this up. I want to get back in here. I bet this little tunnel here leads to the next area, to the last place. Lava? No lava, okay. Oh! There is indeed a tunnel right there. With a bunch of skeletons in there. I don't know what they're doing way back there. Hmm. I think I am going to peek down there as soon as this lava disappears. I may have to get rid of it myself. Whoa! Okay, let me do that. So that they absolutely cannot get in there. Whoa! <laughs> hey Let me just juke this guy. Hey -o. He's dead. He's dead. 
He's dead, Dave. Oh, man, the lava takes so long. I'm just gonna use my glowstone because I'm out of normal blocks. There. I'm gonna kill this guy from a distance. I think he's, yeah, he's shooting at me. And there must be spawners in the wall, I guess. For skeletons to be back here. So, I'm going to have to do some climbing to get up there. I'm going to worry about that another time. I'm going to focus on getting this last wool without getting hit. Uh, just as important, because I ran out of food. So, first thing I need to do is light up all this stuff. So, I'm going to start re uh, replacing some of these with... Ghost oops! With uh, glowstone, like that. And then I guess if I don't want to get hit, I need to sort of advance really careful. Whoa! I just got hit! Ah. Ah. No, 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 no! Oh god, I'm trying to place glowstone. Get down, glowstone! Wow, there's a lot of guys here. I'm real low really what no, stop doing that! little hole there. I must have blown up uh, some spawners that were right there. Okay, oh. Let me get down here make sure that these won't... Whoa! Did I, get... Did I get shot from one of these? I must have. Let me make sure all these pressure pads are gone. Did maybe someone arc the shot? I'm not sure. Oh, no, yeah, they are arcing the shots. And I am low on food. This guy right here. Ew. All right, and once I can get right up here, I can do that. Oops, oops, how did that happen? Did you see that? I thought I had the three selected, not the nine. Anyway, uh, most, of the, most of the difficult part is done. I just need to shut down these, like so. And there's one more layer here. All right, they should all be shut down. Um, now, I think there's a lava there that I can remove. Now, I'm going to spend a little bit of time cleaning this area up, and then I'm going to get rid of all these spawners. All right, <laughs> the room has been cleaned up a little bit. I picked up all the pressure plates, all the lava's gone. I made sure everything was bright enough so stuff wouldn't spawn anymore when the lava was gone. Um, so now that I've done that, I'm gonna get rid of all these spawners at once. Uh, all in one go, so, uh, and then, I, then I'll go collect the wool. So, say goodbye, spawner. Alright, that should be it. <laughs> that is a hell of a lot of spawners. Alright, so now I should be able to go out there and retrieve the wool safely. And one thing I was thinking about, when I come back here, um, after I go back to the Victory Monument, I don't need to bring any arrows, because there are about 10 zillion bajillion quadrillion arrows in this little area, so I won't ever have to worry about arrows again. Not that I really had for a long time, but, um... Careful, don't fall now. Can't reach? Not quite. One more block, probably. And, yeah, I... Oh, God, don't fall off. Oh. Oh, my heart just skipped a beat. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? <laughs> See, this is why you... This is why you make guardrails. And super hostile legendary. Because even though you've destroyed all these spawners, you think you're totally safe. A ghast just might spawn in the middle of this room and blow you off your little perch. Red wool. All right, I will take, I don't know, about half. Oh my gosh. Oh, that scared the hell out of me. All right, time to head back to the Victory Monument, Red Wool. 
The second to last world in the map, the penultimate challenge completed. So first, uh, I'm gonna stop by my little, you know what, I can destroy that, I don't need that corner. Uh, I'm gonna stop by here, and I'm gonna drop off everything I don't need, because I'm gonna be bringing back as much as possible. Uh, more mushrooms, more wheat, more building blocks, more glowstone blocks, all that kind of stuff. Uh, I will bring, I don't, don't even want that. And I'll leave my lava buckets. I'll just bring this. And head back for the victory monument. Whew, with red wool. Man, this chamber was intense. This this sort of middle area wasn't very hard, but that end area was a lot of fun. Alright, here we are. Back in the victory monument with an interloper. <laughs> Who sh who's not supposed to be here. Let me take care of him from my sniper perch. Alright. Spaloosh. Back to the victory monument with red wool. Walk over here to the stairs. Here we go. Red wool on the victory monument. Yeah! Yeah! Only one piece left. The black wool. So next time, we will be seeing what's in that area after... I don't even remember what the, um... I don't even re remember what the, uh, the area with the red wall was called. I, I, I know there was a sign. I don't remember what it's called. I'm sure it'll be in the title of the video. But, uh, next time, we'll be exploring what's beyond there. And probably the, uh, the end game, the last chamber. I may build a house. I may not. I may just go for the finish. We'll see. It depends on what my mood is. Anyway, uh, hope you enjoyed the video. See you later. Take it easy. Have a good day. Stay tuned.